We are not at the table because we are on the menu. Yesterday, we all saw the gut-wrenching spectacle of four creative director mothers and their daughters on this stage talking about sexual harassment as a given, as a fact. And by the way, I wish that every man in our industry could watch that panel because that was just heartbreaking. And on that panel, um, Kristen Emhoff told a story. And I want to reference that story because the biggest issue facing our industry today is not diversity, it's sexual harassment. Because sexual harassment actively prevents equality, diversity and inclusion from ever happening. So, Kristen Emhoff, Kristen Emhoff told a story about how, as a young woman, um, she was going to meet at an industry event, a professional event, a man whom she enormously respected, a creative superhero, someone she was so excited about meeting, whom she really looked up to, and she was introduced to this man in a professional environment, surrounded by other men, her professional peers, and this man said to her, I thought the first time I met you, you'd have your legs behind your ears. I've had many, many stories like this. The young woman, many years ago, in a meeting, in a professional setting, in an advertising agency, at a meeting which included two of the most powerful and well-known names in our industry, and in a meeting where she was the only woman amongst a whole group of her professional male peers and colleagues, where one of those two very powerful men said to her, you look like you really need to get fucked. Here's what happens when you do that to us. You instantly dehumanize us. You strip us of all professional credibility. You reduce us to sexual objects, and you ensure that all the men around us will never look at us in the same way again, and you destroy our career path when you do that.